Good day, can you hear me? Well, I hope that your ears are working better than your tongue, so that you might use them to listen to my words. You have turned on the light at the end, beginning and middle of the tunnel, but some things remain shrouded in darkness. My Morrissey message I hope has helped, but what you need now is to the wall hole to the right of the fence. Oh, go now! There is no time to explain! Well, in fact, time is one of the few things we have in abundance down here. What surprises are spoiled by such catty curiosity? like something with a great many small holes. We shall be needing to perform some minor demolition work so that we might one day meet again. For this task, we shall require the use of a large, earth-eating metal monster, and that monster is thirsty for juice from the place where things are kept. By the way, you can call me Red. It's not my name, you understand, but, but I am sure you will agree. It is a name rather similar to a cardigan. Fetching when worn correctly. my mind are increasingly gaping. You cannot breach the inner sanctum of the place of storing. The entryway is blocked. So what if the squashy material between my ears is squashier than most? I may not be perfect like a hanging picture, but my words are wise and backed up by time. A pox! A pox on both your brain cells! Try as I may, you must think that I deceive you with my admittingly cunning ways. As far as my eye has seen, our rocky grave extends, and yet you cast away my hope like you would a puppy, freshly ruled in its own feces. I hope that your warped sense of morality is better company than I, because now it is all you have left. Um, I'm sorry. Sometimes my emotions are like a disobedient pet. Uncontrollable and often rolling in shit. Better safe than sorry, they say. But I think we are both sorrier than we are safe. A tunnel lies between a nearby watery cave and the place where things are kept. Take the second right from the closed door and you will find what you seek.
Now you should find yourself in the watery cave of conversation space. With a tunnel above you from times ahead. In this tunnel for both our sakes. Be careful, not curious. I have already spoken to you about the cat, and repeating myself is not only out of the question, but out of the window. ...and climbing down the guttering. There are spiders in the tunnels that love to suck on the human fluids, so do not disturb the walls. They are fragile like the china vase in the hooves of the boar. some insect propellant in that red and white cross box in that room. Just in case those spiders found your flesh delicious. How does my brain flesh know your fluids are leaking? Because the red tricked you! <laughs> the spidery tunnel was far from a necessary evil. More so, it served as a well-deserved punishment. You thought my mind had been lost to the ravages of time. But poetic justice has struck with a sonnet and an eight-legged baptism of fire. With justice now served cold, I hope that we can be good friends. Now reclaim the key and go-go juice. And find a way to the mining monster.
There should be some insect repellent in that red and white cross box in that room. Just in case those spiders found your flesh delicious. How does my brain flesh know your fluids are leaking? Because the red tricked you! <laughs> <laughs> the spidery tunnel was far from a necessary evil. More so, it served as a well-deserved punishment. You thought my mind had been lost to the ravages of time, but poetic justice has struck with a sonnet and an eight-legged baptism of fire. With justice now so cold, I hope we can be good friends. And now reclaim the key and go go to and find a way to the mining monster.
the truth behind all this mystery and think it will set you free. But truth is relative and relatives cannot be trusted to bring good gifts. What you seek lies in the shafts beyond this collapsing of the sky and if you look closely, so do I. A century of days has passed since I saw this area last. The diseased ones sought to kill poor Red, but I took them on a wild poultry chase. They ended dead. They came from out the big metal door, but after all my years I knew Hide and seek, turn to seek and hide, and I buried them here beneath the solid rock sky. <laughs> <laughs>